Talk to me about this new format that CIFA is trying out this year, the knowledge cafes. What can you tell me about them and why are they important? Knowledge cafes uh, is one of the best tools to manage knowledge. <coughs> and there is a quasi standard for knowledge cafes. What uh, we learned uh, last decade, and I was uh, really glad to suggest this form of uh, communication, and I was also glad to, to rely on a handful of uh, old uh, colleagues who helped me to make this happen. And uh, since uh, we had to uh, force uh, the, the second uh, round to stop, <laughs> means that people liked it. And what do you think people take away from this type of discussion as a part in, in separation, for example, to listening to someone talk? What is different about this that, that will make people think differently? Uh, there are two main things uh, different from any panels and group discussions and so on. Uh, uh, one of them is that uh, most people uh, are participating. Because if you are in a smaller group, uh, you are rather up to share uh, your opinions and concerns. And second, it's, uh, it's leveraging the knowledge because you can listen to eight other people or 12 other people and at the end uh, your discussion getting wrapped up. That means another dozens of people can listen to the outcome or the conclusions of the discussion uh, at your table. And from listening to other people's discussions around the cafes and the ones that you've been moderating, what are people's main concerns? What are their questions? Uh, what I've seen for quite a time is that uh, regular people and uh, independent advisors, their opinion uh, shows quite a gap uh, compared to the official agenda of authorities. Uh, and uh, let me tell you, the people. <laughs> and now it is... Uh, uh, got confirmed that uh, the concerns of uh, everyday advisors, independent ad advisors and uh, normal clients are different from most concerns <coughs> of the authorities and the regulators. This is no news to me, but now we have a statistic confirmation <laughs> that there are different opinions about regulation and how to manage people's money and uh, how to uh, manage the relationship between uh, independent advisors and clients.